Hello everyone, this is Corpa and welcome to the class challenges of Naxoramus, the military quarters. We got the Shaman and Warlock class challenge at already, so let's hit off with the Shaman class challenge versus Gothic the Harvester. I really had some problems with this guy in, when I faced him with my own decks. So it's gonna be interesting to see what kind of deck we gonna get. Hmm, interesting. Uh, let's remove this one. Reincarnate with a Nerubi neck. That seems to work. So let's see what other things we get. Well, we got two uh, Flame Tongue totems already. So let's head off with the Nerubi neck then. And after that, we can sp start playing the Flame Tongue totem. Kill my minions if you like. Their souls will hmm. pay you a visit. Yeah, it's not so good to play uh, for him. Um, what is smart now? Let's hit off with Haunted Creepers and after that we can play the Flame Tongue Totem and hit off with a Totem Call as well. So just like that. And what is smart? Yeah, let's just kill off our egg. That always works. And then kill it like that. Mm, okay. Now, next turn we can play the Flame Tongue Totem. But for now, let's just get another totem out there. And with the Flame Tongue Totem, we are able yeah, to attack with these minions. Damage. Nice. Uh, let's see. Let's hit off with the uh, cult master. So we can get some cards going. We still will get some damage, but I'll take that risk. Okay. Let's first. Get another card. Nice. If Fugan also died this game, summon Thaddeus. Okay, interesting. Um, yeah, we're gonna kill it. Gonna lose our minion though. But I'll take that risk. Let's see, we need to get another totem out of there. And we need some more minions. Uh, let's get another flame tongue out there so we can attack at least. Four damage. Hmm. That's a waste. That's the first flame tongue gone. Told an overload. Let's see. Death rattle. If we can also die this game, summon Thaddeus. So we first. I have to get Fugen before we should summon this guy. Um, let's see, we have the Earth Elemental. Let's get that one going and another totem. Two damage. It's nice that he keeps uh, killing our uh, totems that we summon. Okay. Take control of a random enemy minion. Sadly, we cannot play that, but let's hit off with Shattered Sun. Another totem. Nice to get some damage on there. Just like that. Two damage. Three damage. Let's see, it can't be targeted by spells or hero powers. Let's see. This one needs to go away. My so let's do I it like this. <laughs> and it has uh, one more HP as well, of course. 
But still it will work. Uh, three damage. I only get one, but well. So be it. Should have done done that the other way around, but well. No, everything in advance. Hmm. I thought <laughs> we even had lethal. Wasn't watching. But well, now we have lethal next turn. Just like that. So unless he summons a lot of taunts, we will have him. I really like this one. <laughs> it looks cool. Yeah, one damage. We will survive. So yeah, let's just uh, hit him in the face. Just like that. Well, that's the first class challenge on the Shaman, and we will get to reincarnate. So, we're gonna be making some uh, other death rattle decks with the Shaman as well, I think. So, with the Shaman class challenge out of the way, we only got the Warlock one left. We're gonna play versus the Four Horsemen. And it's gonna be an interesting deck, uh, I'm sure of it. Probably gonna have a lot of minions and demons because the card we get is a 3 4 creature. And when it dies, yeah, this one, when it dies, put a random demon from your hand onto the battlefield. A bit of an expansive hand though. Uh, so let's get these two out of the way. Just to see. We can get a good starting hand. These horsemen are annoying and you can buff them up quite nicely. Yeah, indeed. Let them come. Well, let's get our taunt out there. Probably gonna silence or kill it right off the bat. But at least he's wasting his good cards on our yeah, lone minion numbers or weak minions even ah this is gonna be interesting um yeah let's get another one out there Green blade oh, it's already good that he's playing it now because his minions are not dead yet okay now let's uh, start hitting off with this Void Caller. You see we have uh, two more demons, or three demons, is currently in our hand. It's gonna be interesting to see which one we get. Uh, not a Void Caller. That'll work. We need a lot of damage. But let's see if we can correct that. Um, yeah, let's just kill off one. Uh, let's see, it doesn't really matter. But let's kill off the one with the most health. I'm gonna use life tap because our uh, yeah because our life will go down quickly. <laughs> A lot of spells, pretty annoying. Room blade is gone now, and he used most of his spells, so that's a good sign. Um, let's hit off with that. And now when he kills it, we're gonna get Lord uh, Jarax. Another rune blade. Why did he play the corner? No idea why he played the coin. But we need some more creatures. Okay, nice. Let's get even more demons. They will help us a lot. Just like that. Wonder what his secret will be. Okay, well. That took care of his uh, second horseman. And let's play the Void Caller, so we don't have a chance of getting it when it dies. Yeah, let's kill off his last horseman. It's a powerful blade now though, but we'll see what happens. Luckily his horsemen are already dead. Nice. Ah. Okay, that I wasn't expecting. Um, <laughs> because he got summoned, his battle cry ability doesn't trigger. But uh, we still have a minion, and yeah, we should be able to kill him now. 
Uh, Let's just see. No idea what his secret it was though then. But we beat him. Interesting uh, combination. That's going to be a real interesting card. Uh, the Void Caller with uh, already uh, available demons in the Warlock deck. So might uh, gonna check uh, that out as well. So that completed all the class challenges that we unlocked from the milit military quarters. So thanks for again for watching. This has been Corpa, and I hope to see you when the Construct Quarters are available. That will be next week. So thanks again for watching. This has been Corpa, and I'll see you next time. Remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed it. Click the right annotation to go to the next episode once it is released. Click the annotation in the middle to go to a video you might enjoy. And click the annotation to the left to go to the previous episode. And remember to follow me on Google Plus as it will help me establish my own brand. Follow me on Twitter for all announcements and my thoughts on things. And join me on Facebook as it is the place where all social media of mine comes together.